Hi, Eileen Bayer, the fam here. Welcome to another installment in our Anti-Stress Activity in Challenges mini-series. And in, in today's installment, we will be covering aromatherapy. So let's um, begin with this session on aromatherapy. Um, using essential oils or burning essential can candle can help reduce your feelings of stress and anxiety in some scents are especially soothing and calming. Using scents to treat your mood is called aromatherapy. And several studies have shown that aromatherapy can decrease anxiety and improve sleep. Now, aromatherapy is an experience which can balance out your emotional and physical state and help you to reconnect to your inner self. Aromas can affect you in your brain in the deepest part, which helps to remove any kind of negative effects on your thoughts and emotions. Also, mas uh, massages through this therapy help relax your body and squeeze those aches and stiffnesses away from you, giving you a soothing experience. Now, there are many different essential oils that are used um, to help calm and relax such as lavender, rose, vitifer, uh, bergamot, roman chamomile, neroli, frankincense, sandalwood, yang yang, orange or awesome orange blossom, and geranium. Also, aromatherapy also has many benefits for both mind and body such as it helps manage pain, improves your sleep quality, reduces stress, agitation, and anxiety through sore joints, treats headaches and migraines, alleviates side effects of chemotherapy, eases discomforts from labor, and helps fight bacteria, viruses, and funguses. So you see there's a lot of benefits to aromatherapy and you can go to, um, they have what they call aromatherapist. Um, um, most, you can even use it in your home, that's simple um, aromatherapy. You can use it by having the candles in different places. So when you get in your home, that's like your safe place, you know, it will help you to relax. Remember, when you're doing anything for anti-stress, not just one thing may work. You may need to do different things. I really would advise you um, to start with the morning. Um, make a morning schedule. Start off with maybe some meditation. Um, then go into the gratitude. Um, do some aromatherapy and then do some exercise ones too, like the um, penny walk is also good. Um, if it's late in the day and it's like been a bad day at work, you could do it in, you know, different orders. But set yourself up a routine for the way you're going to do each one. Now, it it is so beneficial to use aromatherapy. I use it... Um, I normally do it through incense, so I don't have the essential oils. But there's a lot of studies that prove that when you um, dilute the oils the proper way and you rub them on certain areas of your body, that they do help. Um, <clears throat> the lavender is real good for relieving stress and anxiety. Also, they say that um, if you use like a mint one, that helps uh, improve your brain thoughts. Um, do your research and study before you just jump in and apply any to your body. Also, keep in mind that you may have um, some people have real sensitive skin. So they may have allergic reactions or, you know, bad reactions. So take everything in consideration before you do it. But I do recommend trying aromatherapy. 
see how it works along with the other things to help relieve stress because these are the things you can do for yourself to go along with your medications for it. Don't just rely on your medications. Learn the different techniques on how to help cope with anxiety, stress, and anger. And when you combat these things, it makes everything a little bit easier because we all know that in a lot of mental health, different mental health issues, those three things, the anxiety and stress, is always part of it. So if we can eliminate the anxiety and stress, it will lessen a lot of the other issues that there is, so you can concentrate on them a lot more. So remember to try each and every one of these, put in the comments, below whether you use this, if it helps you or not. Let me know your thoughts and opinions because I'm not an expert on any of this, but I do my research and I have found that everything that I have mentioned does work. Um, so feel free to leave a comment in the comment section about your thoughts on aromatherapy. I would love to hear what you have to say. And remember, until I see you again, always see with your heart and not your eyes. Because what your eyes see truly doesn't matter. What counts is invisible to the eyes. The eyes can't see what counts because only the heart can. And that's why it's so important to see with your heart because you're seeing from heart to heart. Your eyes just sees a shell. Your heart sees the truth. So see with your heart and not your eyes. And remember, you out there, yes, you matter to me. You are important to me, and I love you for who you are. So until I see you again, bye. Love you all.